here we are at um, Mount Laurel Cemetery. What better way to cap off a dismal year than coming to a location like this? We're here today for a very special occasion uh, to celebrate the um, birthday of uh, General uh, Meade. He is a um, Civil War general who is um, buried here at the cemetery. We're going to have a great time this afternoon with um, a little commemoration of his birthday. And uh, we're going to have some uh, folks who will be reminiscent of um, a previous era when um, war was conducted differently than um, it is today. Okay, our ceremony is about to start. Oh, I see here that we've got um, lots of Civil War reenactors. Big crowd here today, braving the weather. But we're lucky. It isn't snowing, although snow is on the ground. And uh, it isn't raining either. It's very exciting to be here at an event like this. Are they um, going to shoot at me? Oh my. Hmm. This could be a more dangerous venture than I even thought. Well, these fellows have put their guns away for now. Indeed, this is a uh, fancy procession here. My, my, my. Look at this. And the ladies are here in their fineries. Well, we're certainly here at the uh, occasion of commemorating the birthday of uh, a true VIP. After all, with the passage of time, to still be remembering the general's birthday is uh, quite an accomplishment. And I'm sure that if he's uh, looking down from above, that the general would be very, very pleased. The ceremony is about to begin. March! We don't have music, so we'll have to just imagine there's a beat. We are imagining a beat, all right. Left, 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 right, left. Left, 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 right, left. And the citizenry is going. Listen to the beat. Left, left. Our destination. Watch your step. Notice the thank view you. of the river from you. here. You, what a sight. Thank you, Mr. Price. Right here. Thank you. Right here. Right here. Anywhere along in here. I hope everybody will be able to hear what we're saying. I'd like to welcome everyone again uh, and thank you for braving the weather, uh, the elements, to be here to show our uh, honor and veneration. Uh, uh, support for the work of General Meade, our great war hero, and all his veterans and all veterans, past and present. Okay, we are now seeing the wreaths being laid at uh, General George Gordon Meade's grave. Huh. Arms are being presented. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you, madam. There is no shortage of be wreaths. Careful. Here is another. Everyone is stepping gingerly since the ground is snow covered. We have some family uh, representatives adding their own uh, wreath to the generals. We're now going to see an interesting tradition. Brothers, brothers, on the, tradition the generals' of the Grand Army, we salute General George Gordon Meade in his service to our country. May he continue to rest in eternal peace. Salute the dead. We're going to have some action here very shortly. I 
believe we're going to be hearing of some volleys. I understand uh, three volleys are traditional. They are single shot weapons. So we have a slight weight in between. Too many more of these and I think I could go deaf. But it makes it all the more special. An exciting celebration. Having a series of toasts here with champagne. Here, here. Here, here. Here, everybody, to all my brother Rain actors and sons, and everybody else in the support community. Uh, thank you for keeping history alive. Look forward to another year of doing. Here, here. Here, here. Please. To all the spouses of the reenactors <laughs> and friends for their unqualified support to make all of this happen. Best to everyone. Here, Thank here, you. Here, here. here, here. So off our little ceremony for the great general in the wonderful city of Philadelphia. This is one final view of uh, Laurel Hill Cemetery, General Meade's final resting place. None of these folks have to be concerned with uh, having lost money in the stock market during the past year, nor do they have to concern themselves with the ugliness of the uh, current world situation. For them, it's no longer their problem. Adios.